Employer-employee disputes over low wages and poor working conditions have continued characterizing a number of companies, especially among casual workers. Workers at Polythene Products have been protesting since Thursday, 23rd June, over management's failure to increase their salaries despite government having increased the minimum wage early this year. They claim that management has refused to meet their demands, hence the work boycott. They said the 700 kwacha suspected increment on the current 1,400 per hour is still not enough to meet their needs. We are getting here is too small. So the fact is that you, we, are, we want an increase at this company. So we started in January, the government to say that the, every company should increase the, the percentage of uh, <coughs> the minimum of the wage the wages what to say but from that time until june we are not seeing anything progressing if they don't want to accept our condition according to what we deserve then we are continuing up to next week so how much do you get like per month, per like, month? it's less than five hundred thousand kwach whereby i can't even feed my family mm. the lowest is uh, one thousand four hundred that is uh, per hour that is the lowest. Which, when you multiply this by 200 hours, because we work nine and a half every day. So when you multiply this one for by 200, it's about uh, 260 something thousand. That is a basic salary for an employee. Yes. And union representative could not give a concrete statement over their discussions with polythene management. What I'm saying is right now we are in a meeting with management. These are union officials. Yeah. Oh, right. So we are going to give you, I believe the managing director will give you. We, we have had a meeting and we came to announce what the progress that we have done there and then we are going back in there. Yes. So if you need further information, you may ask for the managing director. A demotivated workforce is a danger to any company's development, hence impacting negatively on the country's economic development.